Hi everyone! This is Sierra and welcome to Runa Passport Stories. Today I'm going to be talking about why my username channel is Runa Passport Stories instead of Sierra Passport Stories. Before I talk about the name Runa, I need to talk about a hobby that I have. I am a part of a group called the Society of Creative Anachronisms, also known as SCA. The SCA is an organization that can be found all over the world, and people within this group research and recreate the arts, skills, and traditions of pre-17th century Europe. Basically, people, people within the community choose a persona before 17th century, and they research how their character would have lived, and they try to dress as historically accurate as they can. There's lots of activities within the SCA. There's heavy combat, which is with, which is with swords and shields, and then there's fencing. Um, there's also archery, there's equestrian events, there's costuming, cooking, metalwork, woodworking, there's music, there's dance, calligraphy, fiber arts, and so much more. So you might be thinking, oh, this sounds a lot like LARP. And it's not. <laughs> SCA is not LARP. I have nothing against LARP. LARPing can be great fun. Um, but LARPing is more of story-based. There's, there's a story that's happening. It's like Dungeons and Dragons meets real world. It's like instead of playing in your around a table, you're playing in a yard. Um, your game. Versus SCA is less plot-based and it's more of we selectively recreate the culture and we choose elements of the culture um, and interest that interest us. And we just try to live as if we were those people while we're at events. I'm sorry if that was really confusing for a description of the SCA. I probably did not do it justice. So I am going to link some websites down below if you would like to research more into the SCA. Because um, it is a really fun group. I have been part of the SCA for about, I think, two and a half years? I think? I'm not quite sure of the dates. And I chose for my name within the society to be Runa Grofelder. And so that's where the name Runa Passport Stories comes from, is from my name in the SCA, Runa. I just really like the name Runa and I wanted to represent my, my community that I was a part of. So my name Runa Grofelder comes from the Vikings because my persona is a Viking that is in the 8th to 11th century because that's when the Vikings were. The reason I chose Vikings is a lot of the people around me were into Vikings and they were a great resource for me to build my persona. And I also just liked the names that the Vikings had. And <laughs> the clothes were a lot easier to make. They're very boxy, straight-lined clothes which was a lot easier than trying to do some Elizabethan clothing. <laughs> that would have been way too much sewing for me. And so while I've been in Korea, I've actually joined the SCA community that exists in Korea. And it's not as large as it was in America, but it's, it's a nice tight-knit group. And yeah, there are a lot of nice people. Um, and in Korea, um, I went to my first event, and this was their baronial coronet where they would decide who the next Baron and Baroness of the Palatine of the Far West would be. And that's a lot. I know that's a lot of words, and you don't need to understand. <laughs> if you're not part of the SEA, it's not important for you to understand what any of that means. Basically, all that means <laughs> is that we were coming together, and people were competing to see who would be in charge of running events <laughs> for the next time period. And they would be like our royalty within, the, within Korea. Um, once again, there's going to be links down below if you actually want to research more about the SCA. Um, and yeah, and so I'm going to show you what happened during it. To decide who would be the next Baron and Baroness, there was an Arts and Sciences competition.
Once the judges decided who had won the competition, the current Baron and Baroness swore the new Baron and Baroness into office. Huzzah! Hip hip! Huzzah! Hip hip! Huzzah! During this event, there was also heavy fighting, and that's always a lot of fun to watch. I hope you like this video and that you now know why my name is Runa Passport Stories on YouTube. Please comment down below if you have any questions about the SCA or if you have any previous experience with that group. Um, and yeah, I hope you all have a great day. Bye!